What's up gamers, Bullets here. I'm bringing you a quick little video of my first impressions of Diablo 3 Ultimate Evil Edition on the Xbox One. At first glance, the cutscenes in the beginning made me feel like it wasn't going to be all that great as they look slightly grainy and it definitely, it's definitely a bad sign. However, after that, the rest of the cutscenes seemed to look just fine. They looked pretty good actually. Optimizing the game's controls for the Xbox One and PlayStation 4, Diablo 3 plays like a dream. In fact, it's very easy to control. Much easier than you'd expect. The graphics, frame rate, and response times are all up to par, looking and playing beautifully with no drop in frame rate that I noticed. At 1080p and a solid 60 frames per second, it's like playing it on PC with max settings. Well, as max as 1080p can go. At $60, you get the full game as well as Reaper of Souls expansion, making this a solid buy for the money. Even if you played it on CD, or I'm sorry, even if you played it on the PC, it's worth taking a look on the PS4 or the Xbox One. I have it on my laptop, and I'm still finding myself having more fun than ever with it on the Xbox One console. My friend and I killed hours last night playing it, you know, two player, two controllers, sitting in the living room in recliners, and if that tells you anything, he, he hates the Xbox company and is a diehard Sony pony. And if he's still having a blast on the Xbox One, you know you will. Thanks for watching. Talk to you guys later. Patience. Not ready yet. Not yet. Not ready yet. Not yet. Not ready yet. Not yet. My power goes vast. Patience. Not ready yet. Not yet. Blessings of the light. 